Hey, what up everybody? This is Steve Breach coming to you with a good old Amazon.com unboxing. This is going to be a hot one. This is one that I've been waiting on for a long time. Uh, I bought it from Amazon, free shipping. If you buy it from a WWE shop, you'll get the same thing. I think it comes with an Undertaker bookmark and it comes with an Undertaker Tops wrestling card. Um, but uh, I bought it from the Amazon, free shipping, two days with Amazon Prime. I don't, I don't talk about them as much because I'm not... Buying a whole bunch of DVDs like I used to. Um, Sting's coming out sooner than later. I know that one. Um, looking forward to it. And um, going to be a, a first day pickup for me. But boom. As you can see, this is a, a book. WrestleMania. Um, Ravi's over there unboxing WrestleMania plaques. The Undertaker unboxing. Um, well, I guess it'd be the Brock Lesnar plaque. For the uh, Brock Lesnar one. I'm so used to getting the Undertaker ones. But Ravi's unboxing plaques. I'm unboxing books, people. 30 years of WrestleMania. Um, this is it right here. Celebrate 30 years of wrestling. I honestly was really excited when they had the uh, pre-sale for the uh, WrestleMania 30 um, Blu-ray. It said it came with the uh, exclusive book. I thought it was going to be this book. It ended up being just like a miniature book that didn't even really have anything. I just saw something on the cover. Look at Hulk Hogan's hairline. Good God. How many people do you think they had to put on that but the Photoshop at the Century to uh, put a little bit on the top? I, I can't remember his hair ever looking like that. Um, I um, Everybody knows I love uh, the uh, encyclopedias. I like to get those signed when you're uh, meeting the wrestlers and such. Um, I got the, um, what is that, the WrestleMania 50 uh, a book when I went to WrestleMania this year. And uh, that was pretty cool. Oh, look, hey. Look, I didn't even realize it. I got the uh, Undertaker card as well. Plus, I get the uh, one of five collectible bookmarks. This thing comes right off, unlike the encyclopedia where it was stuck to it. There's an app uh, thing for the super card and to buy the other thing. Let's see what we got in here. Open. Is it in the back? No. Oh, that. Got a whole bunch of pictures in here. I haven't opened up my WrestleMania 50 book yet. It. Um, oh, this looks badass. This looks really cool. Think of like a little bit. Okay, here we go. I got. Oh, this is bitch in the bookmark. The Slam, Hulk Hogan versus Andre the Giant WrestleMania three. Here is your uh, Undertaker card right there for you. Uh, it says P one on there. But um, oh, dude, this is really really cool. Open it up. You got a whole bunch of pictures on the inside. This is one that I'm definitely going to be looking at for a long time. The last, That book that came with WrestleMania 30 uh, was sort of just like a uh, something to like whet your appetite, I guess, a little bit. But um, it had like the 30 best WrestleMania moments. This is really, really cool. I don't even know what to start showing you first. But it goes through each. Oh, they even got sections on the Hall of Fame in here. Like, here we go, here. It looks a lot like the encyclopedia. There's WrestleMania 9. It gives you the uh, the date, the attendance. Um, it gives you the announcers, ring announcers, locker room correspondent, the WrestleMania host. Uh, you get to see a picture of what the WrestleMania poster looked like, Undertaker's Vulture. A whole bunch of pictures of the guys. There's Jim Ross making his announced team debut. Um, Hogan. I guess that's Hogan winning the championship at the end. Flip it over. Story about Undertaker versus Gonzalez. There's that paragraph written about every match in there. And there's a little bit more of this Hogan with the championship, and he's pointing at it. Are these 75? They can't tell if the pages are oh, they're a little bit stuck together. Boom. Then you go into the Hall of Fame. So it's got a sort of like a weird... Order if it goes from WrestleMania 9 to the Hall of Fame, but there's WrestleMania 11. Bam Bam going up there against Lawrence Taylor. There's Rock and uh, making his WrestleMania debut against the Sultan. WrestleMania 13, of course. Uh, there's WrestleMania 14 with uh, Michaels and uh, Michaels and Tyson. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is cool. WrestleMania access. Uh, right there, we got Alicia Fox down there at the bottom meeting fans. There's your uh, Kane. Uh, here's a whole bunch of uh, memorabilia stuff that's there. Uh, you know, shows you like meeting Natalia. You got Shawn Michaels. 
There you got the Undertaker's Graveyard, something that I've never been able to see before. Um, I guess that's all and on that. Then we go to WrestleMania 16, a.k.a. WrestleMania 2000. Lots of stuff in there. Look at it. It's Taz fighting the APA. WrestleMania 17, one of the greatest of all time. Shelton Benjamin coming off the top in the first Money in the Bank. WrestleMania 21. Where did Eddie grow? I was wondering why I thought that was Daniel Bryan. Triple H, the evolution of a king. Shows you all the pictures of him. Him fighting Warrior. Him fighting Kane. Uh, Gold Dust. This is going to be really cool. There's a whole lot of information in here. Oh, there's a special one to me. WrestleMania 26. One of the greatest WrestleManias of all time. Um, it was my first WrestleMania. I remember being there. Let's see if I can find a picture. If I can show you where I was sitting. Oh, God. That doesn't have the right view to show you where I was. Oh, I got one of those tickets. Awesome. Awesome. Really, really cool. 10 Diva Tag Match. WWE Championship Match. Career versus Streak. Jericho versus Edge. Ooh, Jack Swagger and the Money in the Bank. I guess I can't show you a really good picture of where I was. And that's probably going to be the last page on that. But it looks like you get a few pages on each WrestleMania. And then you get some sort of filler in the middle. I think it's because of the gold out, out outline on the outside. See how all the pages look gold like that? I think that's why the pages stick a little bit. So that's why you sort of got to get underneath them. To turn on a little bit. 187, 188. Then we get WrestleMania 27. Of course, you know, that was the first uh, WrestleMania of the click coming together. This book is really cool. Um, I pre-ordered this. Um, so I can't even remember how much this costs. But it's probably going to be worth every dime I paid for. Um, something to sort of just flip through in my spare time. WrestleMania 5. Oh, the mega powers explode. Oh, there they are pointing fingers at each other. This is really cool. I highly recommend going over to WWE Shop. Maybe even going over to Amazon Prime. However you want to order this. A uh, really cool book. The 30 Years of WrestleMania. You got everybody up on there. I'm trying to think of a name that isn't on there that you would put on there. Where's John at? Cena. No, he's up top. There you are, buddy. Triple H. Undertaker, Rock, Macho Man, Andre the Giant. Tell me in the comments below who you think is the one superstar that got left off the cover of the book. Peace out, everybody. Go buy this.